This is uh, unexpected. Hello, dear friends. Google afternoon, such a, a beautiful, beautiful afternoon. I do not know if you can hear it. <laughs> this is <laughs> a little bit silly. Let me see if we have some friends coming in. We do have friends. And this video is unexpected. I didn't plan to make this video. Just uh, came back and... Uh, <laughs> yes, I need your positivity. I need your positivity. Oui, ça va très bien. But um, I just came back from Bottle Rock, which is uh, a concert music festival. So a little bit too much excitement during yesterday overnight and come back suddenly feel that there is nothing happening or you just get too much excitement, too, too much stimulation and it's hard to come back to your, to your normal life, to your real life. And... Uh, <clears throat> Maybe this is not worthy of your time. Maybe this is not, uh, not respecting you, but uh, I just want to take this opportunity to chat a little bit. And uh, on the one side, it boosts me up. On the other hand, it boosts everyone involved. If you are having a good time, happy time, share your positive energy. If you are, same as me, a little bit lost, lost because of too much stimulation, then maybe this is the time that we just have a cup of tea and cool down and come back to the everyday life. Now let me see if there is any comments here. <laughs> this is my first time. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, a live question. How do you be positive instead of stressed? And uh, so we already have one questions, one question coming up. How do you stay positive and instead of stressed? So for right now, I am doing, I open up a live chat. I just feel lost. Not so much stressed. It's a stressed because I have nothing to do. I have no outside pressure put on me so that I can do something. For example, if I have a, uh, if I have a, a project of deadline, a project, if I have a, a particular cooking to do, if I have a, a clothes to, to, to wash, then I have a very specific topic and specific goal. Right now, I do not have. And uh, I have uh, I have all my goals written here, all my things I need to do written here, write it down. So I want to hear how you do it. For right now, I am just opening it up. I need to get through this time. There is no good words empty words that can get me through it. There are some motivational videos and there are some more uh, insightful and, uh, and wise videos of, uh, of this topic. Maybe you can listen to them. But uh, I want to put it into a very personal and very, uh, very very non-glorious way how I do it. Open up my live chat. 
it helped me to go through this couple of minutes or couple of hours. Once this time is over, and your 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 hormone or your energy will get a little bit more balanced, coming back to your real real life. I went to Napa Valley and uh, went to concert. My life usually quite quiet, and suddenly this fully amplified music, post Malone, so inspiring. His words, his story, his daughter is having one year anniversary, one year birthday, and it's just such a, a touching story. I did not know very much about him, and my son knows. Post Malone is 27 years old. And he said, people can have connection. People see Post Malone growing from not making it, from struggling, and finally make it and become an end game of, of, of a huge concert. He's the closing act on Friday. And all his struggles and he just pursued one thing. And what he said is, no matter what you do, no matter what your passion is, to become an eye surgeon, to become a, a cardio surgeon, to become a, a pizza delivery, to become a, a, no, he didn't say pizza delivery, to, to, to become anything, a music, make art or something, just follow your heart and do it do with your heart and soul. And that is so touching, especially when I have my own children at this young age, that they need to, to try something, that everyone is against them. I can imagine when Post Malone, when 41 pilot, last year was 41 pilot, when Imagine Dragon, when the musicians, when chain smoker, when they started, I'm pretty sure everyone was against them to be in a band, to not make a living, but they follow their heart and follow their, chase their dream. It's just a very, very inspiring. We all have a chance, take that chance and do something, not only because someone is young, but also even at my age, 60 years old, I still need to chase my dream. Still, there is still hope to chase a dream, to take a chance in life. And if we do not take a chance in life, if we do not take this chance and uh, we will just miss it, and the life was not even lived, then we die. At least we need to live our life, to put our heart and soul into something. Music is some of the most inspiring thing, and they make us cry, and so visibly, and so audibly touching our heart. Yeah, so, how do we get over those bad moments? That's what I am doing right now. And, uh, and I hope in one hour time, I will get slowly, get back into life. I have lived in another country and first went to another country. You get excited and then this downtime this is that typical time, and today is that typical time. You get from too much stimulation, and you need to get back into your life. And it's a question of time, and it's a question of uh, slowly reducing your internal energy and get it into uh, a smooth tempo. Do I make any sense? 
That's why you will find a space in life. You will find your real landing space. And we went to Napa Valley. Napa Valley is famous for those lifestyle and all these things. Good restaurant, beautiful, everything. It's like in paradise. It's like heaven. And coming back to our small house, and a cramped small house, and messy everywhere. You see, our oh, life is the real life is quite depressing. But on the other hand, this is the real life. Look at my backyard. And however pretty the restaurant is, however beautiful the vine uh, vineyard is, this is the place I call home, this very place. Lemon is good, behind me peach is good. Come back to land, landing on my place. This is good. I actually, this is so gorgeous. My husband just made some of this water irrigation uh, a timing and things. He spent all his, uh, his time there. Look at this. And uh, there is a peach tree, if you can see it. I don't think I can, oh, I can zoom. Yes, that is the peach. You can see here, these are the flat peaches. Yeah. So it is just this everyday, normal life. And, uh, and come back to it. I just uh, feel <laughs> that is... Uh, so very important. I speak some French, Italian, Spanish, but I'm very rusty. <laughs> so just uh, share some of, uh, of this. I was not uh, making an announcement for it. Just want to open it up. Whoever coming in, coming in. And another thing I I, another thing I find, I am so not good at talking. I am so not good at dialogue. We went to, uh, we went to uh, Bottle Rock and we were sitting in the suite because of some corporate uh, invitation and things. And there are people chatting with you and I see the other table, the big, huge business people talking with allure. And I could not even find a topic to talk. It's quite surprising, not surprising, that uh, I have so many subscribers and people listen to me. But uh, in another world, I cannot talk. I cannot find a topic. And my words is so dry. I think after half an hour, one hour sometime, I, I finally get warmed up and chat with one couple, lovely, beautiful couple from Kansas, and very down to earth, very. And, uh, and uh, something I want to share with you is that do not be intimidated by others. Others are good at something. Those big corporate people, those big speech people, those people who can, who can make a, a wonderful uh, speech delivery may not get a, a YouTube channel. As many, uh, as many people listen to, listen to as me. You get the idea? Everyone is different. My strength is to get people bored, <laughs> to get people to sleep. 
and their strengths is to encourage people, to communicate, to immediately attract people. And I saw some video how to, how to attract people immediately, how to charm people immediately. That's their job. And our, we are not the people who can charm people immediately. But we still have a place in this world. Do I make any sense? Everyone has a place in the world. You may not as good for certain things, but you are good at something else. As long as you live with confidence, with faith for you have, for what you are good at, then you are okay. You live your life, right? Then I live my life. I can always come back to my channel and chat with friends. In the concert, in other place, in the party, in the social gathering, nobody talked to me. But here, there are 37 people with me. You will always have your own place. Do I make any sense? Now let's see what you have read. I have family. Oh, you have written a lot. Uh, <laughs> okay, give me a couple of minutes to try to catch up with you, uh, especially after concert, right? Post-show depression, post-show depression, and the sudden change depression. Georgia, <laughs> I'm drinking chamomile. What sort of, sort of tea? This is Yunnan green tea. There are quite some story about it. Yunnan used to be, um, Yunnan used to be living a quite simple life and suddenly the, the poor became quite famous attract from Taiwan, from Hong Kong. And then everyone goes to Yunnan to get that tea and the landscape of Yunnan changed because everyone making production of it. This is the original Yunnan tea before it was fermented. Anyway, uh, the story I want to tell you is, uh, go back to your root, go back to your root, be the very true self of, uh, of you. Even after watching a real good show on Netflix, <laughs> once it's over, you feel so weird, isn't it? Yes. <laughs> Drinking green tea. Actually, I'm outside of Chile. Uh, where are you going on vacation this year? Are you asking me? I am going to France, for sure. I am going to Spain. For sure, I think this ticket is quite uh, a sure. And then another place I am not sure. I want to go to Edinburgh. I want to go to uh, UK, England. We have some friends say Wales, Ireland, North Ireland, Scotland. Maybe not yet finally decided. Maybe Amsterdam, one direction, one, one part, and then back to, to France and go another trip to, to the UK. That's what I am planning, not yet finally decided. But this year is Europe, not going to other places. Yeah. <laughs> I'm curious myself. I'm guessing Haiyin will travel to France at least. Yes, we travel to France. Mm. Haiyin, happy Memorial Day weekend for all of my fellow Americans. Did Haiyin used to live in France? Yes, I used to live in, in, in France, in Paris, for one year, a complete year, and then we moved to America, yes. Uh, full-time students. 
I like Post Malone, yes. Uh, either make to-do list or the opposite. I sit crisscross, <laughs> staring outside my window, looking at nature. Yes, make, um, make a list or not list. You just need to get over that couple of, uh, of hours time, I think. Yes, her husband is French. I'm such a big Post Malone fan. And yes, if you are a Post Malone fan, maybe it's because you see him growing up. Yes. Ah, it's very touching, very touching to see musicians. Musician is one of the hardest things. And this is why they, when they succeed, they explode because it's all the years accumulation all the musician communities accumulation bind together yeah that's what i thought <laughs> i speak english hanging as a really modern music taste <laughs> i do not have <laughs> much taste i love how connected you are to music argentine i speak some french and Entiendo mejor que hablo. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's see if we have some other questions or something coming. Yes, I am making some more lemon curds before going. <laughs> I could live in that backyard. Uh, kind late, but I'm here. Walter Sullivan. <laughs> I'm jealous. Where is everyone? Country and city check. San Diego. Oh, Madrid, Spain. Water. I am going to Spain. I am going to Spain. Yes. <laughs> I have one family in San Diego. Uh, oh, oh, I lost you. You have written so much. Plus, all my friends are back in New Jersey. Oh, thank you for bringing up this question. Uh, yes, having a convo with new people can be refreshing. I was doing a delivery. This guy, just extremely shy, came out. His head bowed. I complimented his name and his personality blue blossomed. Beautiful. Thank you, Blue Rose. This is so beautiful. Yes. Another thing, I met one, uh, another person in the, in the table. I want to tell you, it's also a very inspiring story. Uh, we ask where they are from. One is making an online company. Maybe it's a founder. An online uh, description-based prescription this the uh, subscription subscription based online um, uh, cosmetics for millennials for different skin type, and I think her husband is making a brewery, and I was just listening to how I made it, and what their story is exactly that that. They already have four shops, the brewery shops. I was too shy to ask how about make a podcast to tell us your story. They are already kind of making it. They, they, they made it, four shops already. Not the huge, huge, huge national chain, but already made it. They must have a lot of inspiring stories. And at the beginning, I was shy. They are shy. Nobody talk anything. Slowly, when you spend some time, story will come. Everyone has a fascinating story to tell. And that is just so interesting. Let's see if we have any new comments and things. U.S. Florida to New Jersey. <laughs> that he looks yummy. Pa 
hard also. New Jersey can be quiet, depends on where you live. Cuckoo, my dear, nice to see you. I'm in Switzerland. Oh, uh, I enjoy the, the silence outside and my silent home because the kids are going by the father. <laughs> Spain, yeah. It will be your first time. Um, Spain, I went to Barcelona last year. But uh, Spain, Barcelona, I know that. Anyway, Catalan. Mm. But this time is Spain, real. Uh, uh, Spain in the, the, the big inland. Yeah. It will be good to be back, missing things with a reasonable distance and having seasons. So good to see you live. You are very inspiring lady. <laughs> I am inspiring. Uh, teeth removal surgery. Oh, any advice to, to stay positive during physical pain? Oh. My asthma has gotten much worse. Okay, so we have one friend is pulling out her teeth. How to stay positive during physical pains? I think physical pain, anyone, please give your advice, give your uh, uh, good suggestions. What I think, when I have a pain or trouble, I distract myself by doing things, by, if this is the time you spend one hour, two hour in short video, in watching cat video, it's not a crime because it helps you to get through it. It, it gets your attention away from, uh, from the pain. If at this time you think about how to make a million dollar, how to become very successful, it's more pain to you, right? You do not need to have those very hard things. Do something light and simple and do something. And yes, the last night, Last, last night, I start to do some drawing, nothing complicated. Start to do some uh, Pokemon, uh, Pikachu, and face, just something simple, and flower. Start to do something. Once your hand is in action, your brain will be attracted by your hand movement. Or when you are doing something, take a shower, soak yourself into the hot tap. All these, these things that gets you away from bed, away from seed, away from sinking, will release yourself. Do I make any sense? Uh, I do not have many uh, complicated different ideas. Do not get too physical. Do not need to go to a concert, to a big thing. Just do something simple and, uh, and uh, indulge a little bit of uh, uh, guilty indulgence, such as what, watching cat video, dog video, silly video, and uh, such as, um, such as, uh, yeah, such as other silly things. <laughs> okay. Have you ever traveled to Iran? I have not yet been to Iran. And I have never been to Iran. And uh, I have met some Persian people. Oh, my goodness. I have wa met one, the most beautiful Persian people person. It just, uh, yeah, 
Yeah. I would drive me nuts without seasons. <laughs> All my friends, I have not. Bilbao, yes. I want to go to Bilbao, yes. Please post some picture on Facebook from friends. Friends is definitely on my bucket list. Yes, definitely. I will post. I will post. Paris, the small streets, and... Uh, and the people, yeah, Paris, please be sure to make a live stream. Yes, I will make a live stream according to uh, American time, definitely, definitely. I will do mm, live stream. If not Saturday live stream, during the, the other time, American evening time. Mm. Yes, everyone has a story, yes. Yes, I need to hop off, sending all you love. Okay, so we are done with the questions. Will you ever be back to Australia? I have not yet uh, thought about, uh, we, we have not yet planned anything about Australia. Not yet, not yet. I do want, and my children, they, when they first, uh, arrived in America, they still think they are Australian. They speak Australian accent. Usually getting busy. The more busy, the less pain, because your, your mind focus in something else. Yeah. Okay, I think I have catch up everything. And if there's no new questions coming up, then we will just, have you ever traveled to Iran? We will just do some blah, blah, blah story and I will go back to, to my life uh, during physical pain. Do you have island fever? I heard it's common in hot climate. Oh, that I don't know. I am 71 and go to concert, travel, and love meeting new people of all age and background. Have a wonderful weekend, everyone. Yes, we have one lady, 71 years old, goes to concert, travel, meet new people, living the life. And uh, as I am getting old, I start to see that older people, <laughs> not uh, discriminating young people, the older you get, the more confidence you have, the more courageous you have. You become very comfortable talking with people because you do not need to worry about people looking at your acne, looking at your skin, looking at your eyebrow makeup, right or not, or those things are no longer important. You have much less things to worry about. And uh, really, living life, it's uh, so beautiful. Hai Ying, do you still draw Pokemon? You mentioned it, and remember you posted video showing a few of your drawing. Yes, yes. For a long time, I didn't draw it. Last night, I started to draw it again. I think I draw Pokemon mostly because my students, they like. If you can draw a Pokemon, ah, they will love you. And I want to please my students. <laughs> That's why I, and, and, and there are some shapes, quite simple and very expressive. I love it. I, I am picking up my pen and pencils again and uh, doing these things. Yeah. Thank you very, very much. It's thank you for helping me to get through this. And uh, <laughs> Pokemon design are very creative. Thank you very much for helping me to get through it. I think I am so much better and 
it's time for you. <laughs> you are on my TV right now. <laughs> the huge screen, right? How is the resolution? <laughs> and uh, okay. Um, thank you very, very, very much. <laughs> How to dye a scarf? What are you talking about? Poupon crazy cat. Make paper earrings. Make tie-dye scarves. I wanted to do it. You know, the scarf like this. This is a pair of a square scarf. The scarf like this is not easy to tie because this part is, has much more fabric and the thick is not easy to tie. So I want to make long scarf and I have a lot of long scarf. I want to make long scarf and tie, tie dye it and it is in my Plan. Tie dye is super duper easy to make. You cannot find anything easier than it. Just the process of putting on the color is very easy. It's very effective. It's very meditative. It's very beautiful. But it's the work behind it. It's just so tedious. You get your countertop all dirty. Even if you try very hard, it's just the, the process of trying to cover up everything and make it in the right place to do it. It's kind of scary. This is one thing. And the steaming part, to choose the right color, to choose the right pigment. Do not use paint paint make it hard. You use the pigment powder and dilute it into water and then finally steam it, steam it with, uh, with pressure cook. That is a lot of, uh, a lot of drop. It's, this makes me scared away from it. Anyway, <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you very, very, very much. I love you. I really do. Do, 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 do. Another thing I am depressed. <laughs> Poxium MX dye. That's a good one. As far as I know, that's a good one. I think it's, a, it's kind of a powder resin. It's... A, it's not acrylic. Yes, yes, that's a good one. And um, I will try to reframe, restrain myself um, from talking too much. I need to walk with my hand. I need to walk with my hand. Meditation. Can you do a video on meditation? That's a good one. That's a good challenge. Because I do my meditation, if we call it meditation, in the concert last night. Let's just do it right now. Meditation. I did it in the concert. In the music, background music of Post Malone background. What is meditation? For me, Meditation is not finding a quiet place. Meditation, I do not know whether this is or not, but that is an inspiring moment for me, is that uh, I empty myself and my, I regain my energy. You do not need I do not need to go to a quiet place to do meditation. Today, we went to Napa Valley. 
beautiful vineyard, beautiful people wearing the most beautiful clothes, expensive wines and the, these things. It is so far away from meditation because even if they say it's a spiritually beautiful, clean spa and things, too much money polluted. True inspiration comes from inside. The big, huge, loud music with every single sentence, every single word with an F in it from Post Malone. It was just so inspiring because that's his way of talking. That is his life. He totally opened up himself. He break up one, uh, one guitar on the stage. It, you can feel he's not making a show. It's all the explosion from internal energy just naturally coming out. Be yourself. No matter who say anything, have faith in yourself. We all have time, we get lost. Today I get lost, but we can all come back, stand on our ground, accept ourselves. I am the most awkward in the party, in talking with other people but I have not a single millimeter lower in the inspiration from other people, from the surrounding. They are, they are so beautiful. They look so confident. Chat with people. Hello, I am investing $3 million. I am investing a billion dollars in this and that. You are not one millimeter less. You are not one ounce less than any of these people. Chase your dream. I cannot become a musician, but I have the same passion and I have the same touch of music the same impact as any of the musicians. I am not the most confident to talk, but I have value. And that is empowering. And one hour sitting to every single F word from Post Malone filled me, filled me with energy, with passion, with the burning desire of life, of making it, of taking the chance. Take the chance. Whatever life gives you, even life wants to put you down, to smash you down. Chase your dream. Thank you very much very much. I love you. I really do. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Cuckoo. Bye, bye.